All right, we're back again to my H-bridge setup. If you can see it up here, you have a motor running. I'll zoom in on it momentarily. These are two different kinds of or setups of Darlington transistors. These are two power MOSFETs. In addition to a motor, I am driving all of these big resistors connected parallel with the motor. All right, first issue is can I drive a 7407 or a 7417 TTL integrated circuit with 3.3 volts? The answer is yes. This is a Pickaxe 18M2. I have set my power supply. The system is operating at 3.3 volts. Let's zoom in on the motor. I'm using pulse width modulation through the system from the pickaxe running at 3.3 volts into the rest of the system and I can get some very very good speed control I'm gonna go ahead and really slow it down at full load it's drawing about 3.6 amps it's a little hard to see on that little meter down below all right, I'm going to slow this down. I mean, that's really good control. Now I'm going to reverse direction. So there's no doubt that 3.3 volts from an Arduino, uh, Raspberry Pi, or pickaxe works just fine with this circuit as is. You don't need any level converters. And you can't get any better with controlling a motor than this let's slow it down again and that's with pulse width modulation and the big box below that this is sitting on is a battery charger power supply. Okay. So that answers the mystery. 3.3 volts will indeed drive a TTL circuit and it works like a charm.